And power 90 only does 51 damage. So you can see how good my crossbow is because it is it is an epic. It is a purple. Uh, so, do that. Put these bad boys over here. So I also found this, which is a staff, which is the one with the big swirls for mages. And it has really good tempo, really good crit, and obviously some good damage. So kept that. Uh, also have this, which I don't know why, because I'm going to sell that. <laughs> I think uh, Matt gave me some good shoulder armor. He did, so um, I'll show you my armor in a second. I have this bow, um, the handmade wood boomerang. It's actually really, really good. Um, neat wood bow. Uh, so I can sell this crossbow. Clean wood bow, neat wood bow. Let's see. 11 tempo. Wow, okay. So I'm going to sell that just because I don't need it at the moment. And don't need that. Let's put these bad boys over here. Yeah, this is just kind of a good amulet if I ever need to stack crit instead of tempo. 6% crit is nice. Um, so yeah, once I hit power 80, I can use this bow. Uh, 50 damage, 11.7 tempo, and 1.9 crit, which is nice. I also have my handmade boomerang, which I might adapt if I ever get enough pla uh, platinum coins. It does cost quite an arm and a leg. But yeah, um, also, let me go ahead and show you my armor here. So, weapon, we went over that. My right ring is 10% tempo. It's only power 49. If I were to, I'll show you what it is to cost to, uh, how many platinum coins it costs. I have a 5.4 and 3 crit. I have a 10.8 uh, tempo shoulder. That is pretty good. Power 78, so it's right, right on my level. And, or, you know, around my level. Good tempo, good crit. Uh, superb linen gloves. I could definitely upgrade those when, when and if I find a better pair. Uh, but it does have a nice tempo there. My chest has really nice tempo. It's only power 63, so I'm definitely in need of an upgrade there soon. Uh, generic white scratched linen boots. That will definitely be upgraded soon. And that's about it. So let's go ahead and find... Um, actually, let's see possibly if there's any better weapons. I highly, 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 highly doubt it. And the the bar is broken there. It's still broken? No. Okay. Uh, power 79. No, not even close. Okay. Um, look for the big, white, tall structure in the sky, which I can't see. Um, where is it? Oh, it's back here. Okay. Anyways, though, uh, I'm going to show you how much it costs to actually adapt these bad boys, and you'll see why it's pretty much just better to grind out and, and hope to get some legendary equipment. <clears throat> because uh, adapting, what it is, is if you come to this uh, place in any city, <clears throat> this tall white structure, this guy will adapt your weapon. What that means is, if your, your power right now, is, my power right now is 79. If I took this chest armor, it's power 63. If I wanted to bring it up to my level, which would bring and translate all its stats accordingly and appropriately to my level, it'd be awesome. Look at that. 12% tempo, 2 point crit, you know, lots and lots of armor resistance, but costs 32,000 platinum coins. Uh, my weapon is, yeah, it's at the right level. This ring, which I really, really, really want to adapt, is only about 4,000, which is in comparison to the chest, you know, pennies, but uh, again, 4,600 is nothing close to how many I have right now. I believe that costs 93,000. I don't understand why, but when you're bringing up, uh, you, you, you're uh, adapting a weapon that's a much, much, much lower power level than you are now. In this case, it's almost you know 30 power difference. It doesn't cost as much, unless that's, it's, there's another number off screen, which I don't think. Um, it doesn't cost as much as things that are very close to your level. Like, that's 68,000 just to bring it from 73 to 79. Uh, 70, look, 78 to 79, right? Power 78 to 79. Only slight increases cost 48,000 platinum coins. Whereas, uh, no, 17,000 still, it's still a lot. So, just goes to show you, I think the platinum coins definitely need to be uh, even then balanced out. I don't know how people ac acquire that many platinum coins while maintaining, I guess maybe as you level up, you gain more platinum coins and you kind of stay more stable power level. So I can see that working, but 
it's kind of unfortunate by because by that point when people are in their you know level 400s 500s they pretty much have their established gear that they're going to be rocking for a while it's usually legendaries or reds or mythicals you know and it's um it's just kind of unfair for anyone that's a lower level anyone if you if you have under power 90 there's really no point in adapting because um you're just going to be spending and wasting all your platinum coins but uh, can I even adapt this one? Yeah, I can adapt that, adapt that one. Anyways, let's go ahead and engage in some quests here. What we got going on? Got a quest out to the north northeast right here. Almost eh, north northeast. So let's go ahead and move on towards there. And while I do that, I shall check my phone to see what time it is. The time is currently 11.13 a.m. I was going to say p.m. It's a.m. So north-northeast, meaning slightly more north than just northeast. Let's get that swiftness and that retreat. Woo! Woo-hoo! Woo-hoo! Uh-oh. Water. Land in the water. Good. <laughs> that could have ended very poorly. <laughs> we were going quite fast. There we go. Let's get this last beetle right here. Okay. <clears throat> and now while the bark beetles don't actually drop anything, they just are awesome experience. A really good experience, actually. Uh, piggy, piggy. Now let's go ahead and use a little bit of retreat here. Get a little bit of a boost forward. Hang glide. <laughs> uh, I kind of missed the hang gliding. Oh, I've swiftness. Whoops. And retreat. And there you go. My retreat's gone. So is my turtle. <laughs> I accidentally hit the, the retreat button. I didn't mean to. Or the swiftness button, that is. I'm getting all jumbled up here. I'm trying to think about what to say and how to say it. Alright, north, northeast. Are we close at all? Now oh, we're making some headway. On the road again. Do 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 on the road. Oh, witches. Okay, that could have that could have been very very bad if they were not friendly. Witches in this game are OP with their laser beams of death. Oh, uh, ah, kind of lost the retreat there. Oh, I gained a little bit there. This is friendly. Nope, not friendly at all. Goblins also have a chance to drop water ice, which is kind of good why I'm fighting these guys. There we go. 666. Six, six. That's totally not the devil's number. Totally not. Oh, I should be picking apart flowers. I I'm so used to being on my mage account where all I do is just heal myself, but I definitely need to pick up some heart flowers along the way so I can make potions. Yeah, I'm only rocking... Uh, 20 potions. It should be rocking a full stack, but... Whatever. Whatever. I do what I want. <laughs> what is that from? I think that's from South Park. I think South Park referenced it from something else, but... I'm not sure at the moment. Friendly? Yep. And we are approaching. Soon approaching. I'm hoping this is a ruin. I don't feel like tackling some Saurian or Troll... The Saurians and the Trolls are, you know, those big dinosaur green-looking guys and the Trolls. Um, they don't scale to your level. They have a set level and will always be that set level. So once you get even to my level, which is, you know, 70-something, it's not very high in the, compare, in the grand scheme of things, but um, they, whoops, they, uh, they don't scale. So they'll stay, you know, I'm just going to toss a generic number. They, they stay at their level 20, and which makes, which trivializes the fact that you know, once you get to higher levels, they are pretty much just pushovers. You kind of just look at them the wrong way and they die. <laughs> so, <clears throat> let's go ahead and use some scout swiftness. Get to this force a little bit faster here. Ah, yes, sweet. So it is, luckily, a... Oh, am I going to die? Oh, no, I just took a lot of damage. Ow. Uh, I'm going to use this bed, actually. While I have the chance. Um, it is a ruin... The ruins of Durmador, Dur 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 Duramore. It is unfortunately, though, a white ruins, which means it's going to be extremely easy. Yeah, it's going to be kind of just unless they're 
you know, plus leveled mobs, which I still doubt. Um, I'm pretty sure there's going to be generic white mobs, yeah. Oh, they're blue. Okay, so, you know, that's not horrible. Let's get the skeleton out of the way. Skeletons are annoying. They have so much HP, and they just, they're just buggers. They're just annoying. Oh, gotta be careful here. I'm taking a little bit of damage. There we go. Alright, so I kind of ran in there a little bit willy-nilly, but, um... I'll be careful for next time. Now I know... Now that I know how strong they actually are. Let's go ahead and... I don't have any good mushroom spits. Can I create any potions? Hmm. Should go make some more potions. Is there any water nearby? Come here. There we go. Any water nearby? There's a river down there. Yeah, you know what? Let's go ahead before. I I rather not just you know die because I don't have enough potions. That's just stupid. Uh, so let's jump in here and create some potions. Uh, heart, oops, water flasks. Okay. I'm not gonna make these all. I'm just gonna make a few of them. Oh my legs. So I I I would hope that someone notices that my mic quality is a little bit different. Maybe maybe not. Um, and. I actually did get a new headset. I got a Logitech H390, I believe it is. Don't call me on that. And so, uh, it's it's a headset, which is nice. What I had before was a standalone mic, where I would basically... Actually, wait, hold on. Can I not eat? No, I can't. I do that. There you go. Um, which was a standalone mic, which means I couldn't... Uh, it had to be on a desk. And um, it wasn't even the type of mic where I could um, be, like it couldn't even be in a shock mount or like a stand or anything. So it was kind of more annoying than anything, frankly. And so, um, hey turtle. So I got myself a headset just because it's a lot easier to use in my opinion. Okay, let's get up here and grab this heart flower. And so, yeah, I'm using a headset now, which is nice, because I have this mobility and freedom that I can use my mouse. Well, that's probably just give everyone some motion sickness there. Uh, it's just a lot easier. I, I am actually planning to upgrade to the Razer Tiamat 7.1, which is a pricey $200, but I have been working a lot over the summer, and uh, YouTube has been a lot more forgiving and, and a lot more nice to me, so I can uh, afford that. Luckily, luckily I can afford that. So let's go ahead and let's go ahead and do this. That I'm getting. If I say prot, uh, uh, admittedly I don't know what prot stands for. Someone wants to tell me. Uh, I don't know what prot stands for, but all I know is that in gaming it's when you get a special ability uh, based off you know, random generation kind of thing. Um, and so whenever I get that purplish glow. That is because of my ability here, Scout. The attacks have a chance to make your next attack instantly rechargeable. Uh, that is due simply to, like, I just prod it there. That's the expression, uh, to my knowledge. Not prod, there you go. And just walk up here. This guy's probably going to heal. Got him before he even had a chance. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Pop some scout swiftness here. Look how fast that is. And I also have the, uh, what is it? The ice spirit cube that I put on here. I believe ice, all the spirits have their own unique qualities, but I believe the ice spirit, what it does or what it allows you to do is it makes the enemy's movement and attack speed slower. It could, it could be just movement. I think it is just movement. Um, but all I know is that it's really cool. Put a bunch of ice and wind spirits on there. It's really, really nice. Uh, let's go ahead. Come on. There you go. Yeah, prodding is really, really helpful. I'm going to build up some mana here. And prod. There you go. Shoot off my special attack. Oh, that's going to do nothing. Whoops. I should kick him. Hit him.
There's a bunch of enemies here. Let's go scout swiftness on their butt. Get this guy. Oh, they're doing a lot of damage. There you go. Sweet. See, the crossbow and the ranger are still pretty useful, as long as you know what you're doing. And long, I think early game might be a lot harder now, uh, but we'll have to see. Okay, there's a bunch of stuff here, but I do... I don't think I'll be able to level up, but I kind of want to... Engaging these guys upstairs here. Get a little bit of uh, experience going on. And uh, I'm going to have another mushroom spit. Just to heal up my HP a bit. Okay, that's good enough. Let's get these guys down here. I'm going to save my... Uh, I'm gonna save my swiftness for. Oops, I missed that guy. You're dead. I'm gonna save swiftness for the boss here. He's just over there. <clears throat> yeah, I should be able to. Oh, there's some more guys here. I should get in here. Watch out for the spikes! Oh, these guys are doing a lot of damage. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, you heal, I heal. How about that? Is that fair? Damn rogues, man. They just do tons of damage, even as just regular mobs. They just do tons, tons and tons and tons. I missed. That sucks. <laughs> okay, and everything else dead in here? Okay, think so. <clears throat> Go ahead and drink a potion. And <clears throat> time to engage the boss. So I'm going to toss my scout swiftness on. Hopefully prod him a few times. Oh, he's not going to last long at all. Oh, I should be building up my MP. What am I doing? I'm dumb. I'm just shooting off my uh, special attack, but I'm not realizing that I need to build up my, my mana points first. Oops. Ow. Okay, he's dead. I uh, kind of liked if he wasn't so close, but I'll deal with that. He's almost dead. Okay, dead. Goodbye, level up. And, uh, oh, Fire Spirit 78, nice. That was actually to my level, I didn't realize that. Didn't seem like it, though. Um, anything else? No. Still power 79. And got a couple of points here, I'm going to put one there, and... I think I'm going to keep Retreat as 30, I don't think much, any much more than that. I am going to probably invest more into Kick, and, uh... Yeah, you know what? Actually, I'm gonna put some into Pet Master to get some more HP into there, um, some more health points for that bad boy. There's surprisingly no enemies in here. Any chests? Oh, there's a chest. Iron gloves, iron wand. But they're all plus 20, so they're kind of worthless. Now, quick and easy way to get out of here, because this is more or less skill to my level. Find a spike tribe and jump. Oh, and it's not really not. These are like level 1 spikes. The spikes actually work towards your level, so. I'm better off just jumping out here. Um, the spikes more or less are, are geared towards your level. Yeah. Oh, pff, okay. Sweet. <laughs> Pretty sure those spikes just propelled me directly towards... Uh... <laughs> that was awesome. Uh, pretty much propelled me directly towards the the window. Now, should I go back to town? Hmm. No. I'm going to head towards that quest right there, and then go into a new biome. <clears throat> yeah, that sounds good. Okay, let's, um, let's check what's over this cliff, and if we can... Wolves are also a great experience. Really, really easy to kill, and they drop 9 experience each, so... Or, you know, around 9. 8 or 9, yeah. Um... I was going to use Scout Swiftness and Retreat, but I'd rather not do it over a cliff where I can just take oodles and oodles of damage, so I'll do it here. There we go. There we go. Keep jumping. And use Retreat again. There we go. There's also the way to double jump here is to... Um, you can do it any anytime. You don't need Retreat. Uh, it's when you jump you kind of uh, roll as you jump, and then you can jump again if you time it right. So I'll show you on flat land here. It's a little bit easier to see. Oh, more wolves. Hello, wolfy wolf. Is there a wolf boss? I think there is. I just I don't think I've encountered it. Come here. Come here. Come here, dummy. Uh, 
Um, I think how to do it is, yeah, just um, you roll as you are jumping. So roll and then jump again. So roll. Uh, oh, wow. I'm messing up here. Sorry. Roll and then jump again. So you get a little bit of a double jump. And it's really nice with the retreat because you can do that and then jump again. And it kind of prolongs. Uh, I mean, with retreat is the more you're on the ground, the more contact you make with the ground, the slower you're going to go. So um, it's kind of better to have more air in that sense. You're dead. Oh, oh water ice! Yes! Yes, I got it. And I got it on camera. That's awesome. Sweet. So now we can get ourselves a spitter. And I'm hoping we can find a lake soon. That would be really awesome. Sweet! Water ice is one of the rarest drops for mob... Um, for uh, water... Water pets. <laughs> for um, pet foods. They're one of the rarest drops. So that and cinnamon rolls are very, very useful. Sweet. Now we can get ourselves a spitter. Cool. So we're going to be on the lookout for any lakes large bodies of water where we can find some spitters. Let's get over here. Oh, nice campfire. What's this guy, goblin? I don't need to kill you anymore. I got myself a water ice. Let's see if we can get over here. Come on, turtle. There you go. Love the ability to just look at him and just press uh, press F. Is it, oh, sorry, R to ride him. Just like, hey, what's up? You want to go for a ride? Okay, cool. Alrighty. I'm happy. Got a water ice. It's my first time getting a water a uh, second time actually getting a water ice. The first time I was dumb. I got the water ice and then I got it on actually just a random, like low level mage. And I accidentally deleted the mage because I wanted to make a new account. And I was like, Oh no, what what did I do? I could have at least transferred it right over to a main account, but uh Spitter is one of those like notoriously kind of rare pets to get. It's it's random too, right? The drop uh it drops from a few different mobs, but the likelihood of it dropping is completely random and pretty small actually, so um but yeah I'm happy. Sweet. As soon as we find ourselves a spitter we will definitely uh use both the turtle and the spitter. Turtle being more for um uh, grinding up a bit, you know, taking on harder mobs, harder bosses maybe. And spitter just kind of for the HP bonus that it gives. What is this? Eh. We could sell it. Why not? Oh. Not so friendly witches. Let's do it. Watch out for the beam of death! Beam of death! Beam of death! Beam of death! Look at that. Look at that. Look how strong they are. Holy moly. They are so, so strong. Yeah, they're power level 82 there. And then, then we have Skull Bulls here. I'm like, ah, Skull Bulls, yeah. So worried. So very worried. Yep, Skull Bulls. I remember, you know, it's like when you start the game, every mob is a hard mob. And then you, you know, play more and more, and every mob is an easy mob. So it's kind of cool. I like that, that, how that works out. Can we engage in that guy? Oh, he dropped something. Probably nothing special, but... We shall go check it out. Some kind of bracelet. Yeah. No. Level 42 do not need. <clears throat> gonna take a quick nap here. Oops. Recover some HP. Look at those numbers flying up. Okay. And continue to progress towards. Yay. Wee. <laughs> Look how fast his little feet are going! <laughs> ah, there's the ruins. Oh, that's a... Whoa! That's really, really cool looking. I, that's not even the right quest, but I want to go explore that. That looks really, really cool. It's on some mountain top. Looking all fabulous and what have you. That's cool. And cows are just easy experience. They don't give as much as other mobs, but there's still a lot of experience. There's still a good amount of experience, so... Uh, Matt and I have sworn to kill every cow we see. Curlon Palace. Now, this is a white place, but let's see what kind of mobs we got in here. Ah, just generic humans. Okay. So, we know that's on the map there, but that's not our goal. Ghoul. I said that really weird. That's not our goal for this episode, so... Or, so for this moment, I should say. 
Uh, I messed up. I should have stayed on my turtle. And that's it. I messed up the retreat. That's why it happened in the first place. Okay, is this a lake? Oh, is this a lake? Can we find a spitter? Can we find a bumblebee? I don't want a bumblebee. Uh, it's a large body of water, but I don't, I don't think it's actually a lake. Oh, corn wings. Okay. Let's continue this way. No spitters. Okay, just a big body of water, right? Yeah, actually a really big body of water. Look at that. If I had any you know, amount of boat skill, I would have put it in there. Ooh, there's a boss there. There's a plane runner boss. Uh, this is not going to be difficult at all, but whatever. And there we go. There's another one over here. There we go. Come on. I missed every shot. <laughs> a plus 20 spirit, yeah. So let's see if I have another plus 20 spirit. I can always combine them. Uh, but I don't think I do. Oh, I do. There you go. So now I have a plus 24. It adds up, and I'm pretty sure it's the same way as leveling in this game, where you know, if I combine a plus 50 and a plus 50, it's not going to give me a power 100. Uh, it's most likely just going to give me a um, you know, 52 or 53. So it's kind of like diminishing returns in the sense, but not really. I don't know. Yeah, I win. You lose. Okay... Are we close? Mom, are we there yet? Okay, it is a, a ruins or a palace, so that's good. I like that linearness to it. Kind of just go through it all, find the boss, kill the boss, the end. Jitsing. Oh, there's a bed here, too. Sweet. So if it gets too dark, we can come outside and skip the night. But let's see. What are we dealing with here? At least blue. Okay, so they're, they're blue. That's not bad. Let's go ahead and uh, get, some, get some damage going on here. And there we go. These guys are dead. Oh, this guy's still alive. But he's dead now. Power 75. Okay, so they're a little bit a little bit below my level. Uh, just based on the items that they're dropping. Which is not horrible, though. Uh, they're not terribly low leveled. Uh, I feel like that's going to be a dead-end room. It might not be. We'll see. Let's go ahead and engage these guys here. I need to prod, thank you. Because the prod does a bunch of damage. There we go, leveled up, nice. Gotta hear mage. Doing too much damage. Oh, turtle. Yay, loot. Oops, lots of humans there. Um, let's build up a little bit here. Hit them all. Get out of here. Oh, okay. Bam, there we go. I might go into a, a random seed, like the, the the designated seeds, and pick up a legendary lamp, the yellow lamp, because it's really, really, really bright, and it's kind of nice, but I don't know. We'll see. Let's bypass that. Okay. And kill this one, kill this one. Oh, I'm getting attacked. Come on. Hit it. Hit him. No, Q. No, not mushroom. Jump. Okay, luckily those spikes were not strong. The spikes could have easily killed me. I uh, got a little over my head, and this mage, man, mages do so much damage. They just do a ridiculous... And the rogues, too. Okay, I can't see now. <laughs> rogues just do a ridiculous amount of damage. And I'm about dead. Ooh. Ooh, man. 16 health. That's very close. A little close. A little too close for comfort. This mage is just annoying. Okay, you know what? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm looting everything. I'm pulling a Matt Delta. Urgh. What? Oh, I'm on my turtle. Man, that was a little too close for comfort. Those are weak spikes, though, luckily. Or I would have died easily when I tried to jump over them. Oh, I didn't see these guys. Hello. Nope, 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 nope. Get my butt kicked. I'm being a little, little not so wise. And the dumb me, I didn't have my the potions equipped. Because I'm very intelligent like that. 
Okay, let's uh let's kill these guys here. Okay. And GG there. Ooh, ooh. I somehow didn't take damage there. These spikes really I I'm not no, I'm not even gonna test it. Those spikes I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try it. Got a unique iron shield. Uh, not exactly interested in that. Nothing good for my level. Okay. Which way to go? Let's go this way. <laughs>